Welcome back, everyone. Uh, last episode, we ended off by dropping off our gifts, and as of right now, the baby Jesus has been born. So <laughs> Christmas Eve has passed. Uh, it's time to unwrap the gifts that we received. So let me open my gift. Oh no! Got lots of stuff. Uh, let me create room. Uh, book of emeralds, a bell, very nice. So I can see the, the pillagers are coming. Uh, I do know who uh, gave me that gift. Let me uh, four or five, 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 three or five. Uh, let me open one or five first. Two, five, five. Because uh, this secret Santa uh, asked me what I wanted for Christmas, and I said, uh, so gray, black, red, and orange. Nice, nice, nice. Because I'm, I'm probably going to need that for like the windows uh, in the castle. Very nice. And I got another box that's full of food. A secret center. I wonder if that's the same secret center. Cloth napkin. I love that. <laughs> oh, that's actually funny. Uh, water bottle. Lovely. Thank you, Santa. So, uh, some lovely gifts. Uh, yeah. Let's uh, fly back. Let the castle appear in the sunset. That's that much money, what makes it nice. Too bad you can uh, stop the sun from moving. Well, you can with commands, but. Um, here, my reflex of pressing tab again. Uh, see, all the chests are in their typical uh, Christmas style. And. Uh, let me place these down. Two, three, four, five. Uh, let me get my goodie. Put this one, this one, and this one in. The bell, of course, belongs here. And that's about all of that. Let's put this on this banner here on its temporary location. Which is uh, starting to get a bit crowded over here. Conquered many pillager, uh, what do you want to call it, scouting parties. And apparently also a raid, which I think I got the achievement, so I think I haven't done it before on the server. A full set of netherite armor, haven't done that. Use a compass on the lodestone, haven't done that. Uh, have every potion fact applied, oh, I remember doing that with Gardex. That, that's that was tough. Was that the last server, or is that this one? I think that was the last server. Um, but yeah, uh, let me go up a few floors. So I can remember what we were working on. Up, 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 up. I think it's where I need to go. Yes. Oh, yeah. The bookshelves. Um, I think what we need is just to go lure some cows. And let's hope uh, it goes better than the, my quest for chicken. Get some wheat, and let me go get some leads, because I know I have leads. Because apparently the uh, wandering traders keep dropping them when they get separated from their uh, llamas. I have them somewhere in here, yeah, two leads. Maybe the 
chest upstairs. Let's see, over here, over here, over here. No. No. Okay, just two leads of this. Um, X is starting to get a bit low. Ticket economy. I have to say, you get two cars. Of course, there's a chicken right here. Oh, I, I, I hate you. <laughs> Like this is ADF trees. This is in this entire area. Oh. Nice with the goats. Ooh. Let's test one. Okay, that's not very good. Dream. Don't particularly like that one either. like VFX media or something one of those like uh, before a movie starts you have like uh, this uh, studio studio work from it and they all have like their little uh, intros like monkey paw and uh, I think there's also one named like temporary named or something uh, but one of them has like big noise and it sounds like call um, yo I like that one best so far. Ponder. Happy. Singing. Feel. Ooh, I love that one. It's very scary. I think that's the one I had in the one uh, OMG game. I think that might be the one on my channel if you want. You can check that out how many other people live it. Let's see, let's find a camera. The thing is like once the server starts, like people kill all the animals, except for sheep and sheep. Little use. After like the first video came, and uh, like all the planes out of this game. Oh, cows! There we go. Get him right here. There's a chicken here, so come on, jump, 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 jump. Shouldn't have put them there. Can we run? We can run. Uh, I actually forgot whose beacon that it that is. They have like a like you'd think that this is like a big underground thing. It really isn't. If I could check that once, no, I'm not sure because there are people who do have like huge underground bases. But like with a triple beacon, you expect like something rad. But it is not there. Go to the right. Just 
course not. No, they've, still, they've still got the hero of the village uh, effect on me. This looks really cool. Oh, 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 oh. I lost my guys. One and two. They look like hills. And you're probably going to spend a lot of rest of your life in like some awful kind of captivity. So, yeah. Enjoy it while it lasts. Get over here. Uh, silk. Doesn't matter much. And we'll put you next to the sheep. Not together with the sheep, but next to the sheep. Um, maybe even put you inside. Yeah, let's put these guys inside. Or just here. Just here is fine. Okay, Lincoln. Uh, some grass grow. Um, uh, let's start work on our letter farm. Um, let's see, can you two breed again? Not yet. Let's put this in here. Let's check if we have a piece of paper. That's all I need to go. Okay, uh, let's find a ladder. Maybe some six them to make a ladder. Okay, I'm gonna start off our dirt and grass. One, two, three. You guys want to breed? Put my, yeah, well, let's just put the looting sword away. And I will be back later for a little break. Okay, I'm back. And uh, as I was doing the Nova Arcana CTM map, CTM map uh, a few days ago, I realized something uh, was missing from my. Uh, from my medieval themed uh, HBO show inspired castle here. It's uh, like these people's every need. They have some comfort, they have a view, they have a uh, staff eventually uh, to support them. But what they, what they need is warmth. These people need uh, some kind of fireplace. So uh, it's a bit tricky to decide because I really didn't design these rooms with that in mind. I think this is a good spot. Uh, I did some minor, minor design work on this uh, off camera. I think I have decided upon this as the version I want. Uh, let's see. Two, three. There you go. better if it's a full block. Not sure. Let's do the other one with just like 
pretty simple bench here where you can sit to warm up. You could even pop your potatoes in there. Uh, the first I thought about putting hay bales underneath to create more smoke, but there's really no need. So, uh, yeah, let's try to incorporate this into the rooms. Okay, 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 okay. Over here, uh, does it point fit? Uh, I guess here there's space. Go. Is it tight squeeze? Two, three. There we go. Hmm. I think I actually like it better with just a full block there. Maybe have it stick out one more block as well, because a bit weird like it's into like this curved side of the building anyway let's go to the next floor uh, this little room oh you don't get a fireplace uh, this one does and where should it go oof Guessing over here, yeah. Well, we can make this one a bit bigger. Um, get over here. You, you. that everything goes through there to the outside. I like it like this because then you can't walk into the fire as well. Yeah, lovely. Okay, um, let's get to the next floor. Did we do that one yet? I don't know, we, we didn't do that one yet. But we get to design uh, the room with something like that in mind. Let's let's not put a fireplace near the books. Or maybe maybe I will put like a little fireplace over here. Like a little reading area. Or is it gonna do the council chamber? I'm not sure. Anyway, that's something for next episode. So I'll uh, say goodbye to you all. And uh, hope you enjoy these last few days of the year. And I will see you next time. Bye.